Welcome to the Simplified Logic video tutorial on an introduction to Nitrobomb. Nitrobomb allows ProEngineer or Creo and Microsoft Excel to talk to one another. It allows for a bill of materials to be extracted out of a Creo session and be created inside of Microsoft Excel. It also allows for information and data to be changed in my Microsoft Excel workbook and then import it back into a Creo model or assembly. Okay, so we've got a shaft assembly open in Creo right now. I'm going to open Nitrobomb and export out a bill of materials. Nitrobomb is going to export a bill of materials for each one of these green checkboxes that I have here. So these green checkboxes represent different types of bill of materials that you can create. If you don't want to create a particular bill of materials, then you just uncheck it, turn it red, and won't export out that particular type of bill of materials. For purpose of this video, I'm going to export out all four bill of materials as well as my all parameters report. So come down and click Export Reports. It's going to open up Microsoft Excel and start creating different worksheets for those different green checkboxes. So I get a full bomb, a full summary bomb, a summary, and a total components list. And then the last one is my all parameters report. So the full bomb is a bill of materials that lists each component each time that it finds it. So every time it finds a component, boom, it puts it, creates a row for that in Excel. It doesn't look at quantities. The colors you see here are corresponding to the colors over here. So my assemblies are sort of this grayish blue color. The parts are this yellow color. My full summary bomb rolls up my quantities. So in the example of my roller here, it shows that I have 12 of them. It doesn't list them out like it did in the full, full bomb where it showed a row for each roller that it found. My summary bomb is a listing of every assembly that it finds, and it shows one level deep of the components within that assembly. My total components bill of materials is just a listing of every model that it finds and shows the quantities for that particular model. And the all parameters report is similar to the total components list, but this is where we can manipulate ProEngineer. We can change values, add parameters, delete parameter values. We can also rename our files in the all parameters report. So that's an introduction to Nitrobomb. We're going to get more detail later on how to do some of these functions as well as talk about some of the settings within Nitrobomb. Thanks for watching. Please check out other video tutorials from Simplified Logic or visit our website at simplifiedlogic.com.